What's up? What's up, y'all? It's your boy AD up in the spot. You feel me? That's all day. Today, man, MGTOW video. Today, finna talk about child support versus adoption. And I'm gonna try to make this quick, man. This is crazy, though, man, because it's like, yo, this shit, to me, this shit should just not even exist. Like, why in the world does child support even exist? Why? When a woman can just give a damn baby up for adoption, just like that, and nothing happens. Does that make any sense? This is why I be looking at a lot of dudes like, man, these dudes need to wake up. Because, man, I am getting so tired of dudes. I swear I see this too damn much. Men who will downplay other men, treat other men, use other men. Like, these damn new generation of men that's raised by these women are literally acting like women, man. Using other men, down-talking men, putting up women, being around males to just use them. Like, for real. And I mean, and I don't see women standing up for nothing. And they always claim equality and all this crap, right? They always want to claim equality. But what's so equal about that? What's so equal about a man being forced to pay child support who may not even want to keep the child, but a woman being able to give her child up for adoption? Tell me, like, that blows my mind because it's like we shouldn't be existing in this. We shouldn't, like, that don't make no sense. So, you know, men, it is men who have gotten their lives destroyed over child support, over a damn kid. You know how many men out here had a baby they really didn't want to have and a woman just fucking kept it anyways and tried to attack them? See, that's what makes it unfair right there. Like, you had a baby, but a man has no judgment of what can happen to the child. If a man doesn't want to keep it, but if you, the female, want to keep it, then there's nothing the man can do about it. That's some unfair ass shit. And then you got, and then you wonder why men don't want to get married to women like that no more and take them seriously as much no more. Because look at all the bullshit we got to deal with when you deal with a woman. Like how many women will honestly step up with me and be like, "Yeah, you're right, Adidas, for real." How how many? Seriously, how many would be like, man, you right, bro. You right. You done fucking did your shit, man. You know what, man? I'm a woman. You're a man. I'm going to respect you for telling the truth. Hell the fuck nah. Most of these damn women going to look at me like I'm a fucking evil dude and tell me to shut the fuck up because I'm giving up their privileges that they shouldn't even really have to begin with. You know, these women don't understand that they've been given these certain things just so you can fuck your life up and fuck men's life up. Because if you fuck men's life up, you basically fucking the whole world up, the whole country up. Because men is what really helps support this stronghold and support this country. Men are the ones who built this fucking country and built most things that you know and see today. Men are the ones who have fucking accomplished the most. In this fucking world. But for some odd reason, women think like, oh man. Like, and, and and the crazy part is there's nothing holding women back. Like women can be a lot. They really can, but they don't want to. That's just the whole point. Cause they got it so easy. And they got all these fucking privileges. And they can just I mean, man, yo, it like come on, child support and adoption, my bad, but I need to stay on topic. But it's like fuck this shit. Fuck this shit. Motherfuckers going to jail over a child they ain't probably ain't even want to have or keep. But all of a sudden, oh, a woman can walk free because she gave her child up for adoption. She can walk free, don't have to pay no child support, don't got to do nothing. She could just go on here and then walk. Nothing's wrong. Nothing's wrong. Why is men out here, again, who are basically forced sometimes to have kids? It's men out here who have been tricked into having kids. Okay. And just giving too much props to these mothers. I feel like we live in a world where moms get too much fucking credit for nothing. While men get no credit. We get no credit. Even though the woman wouldn't even be able to have the child without us. But for some odd reason, she has full authority. Always gets them. Hmm. I could take it even a little deeper, though. Because of the fact, I do believe that that shit is they karma coming back to them. Like, they may have all the authority over the kids and all that. And they think that having a child is all fun and sweet. But that's going to be your karma coming back to you in the long run. Because of the fact, your kids, you need your kids to be supported. 
your kids is your backbone when you get older. And so far, what I'm seeing, since all these mothers want to raise their damn kids like conniving as women, all I'm seeing is a whole bunch of narcissistic kids now that don't barely know how to do shit for themselves besides work a slave job and be fucking stupid all fucking day that don't know how to fucking invest, not know what things really are, do not care about helping real people and others. They don't give a fuck. So you know they ain't going to give a damn shit about helping their fucking mom. They ain't going to give a fuck. And they think, oh, I'm having these kids, I, uh, you know, just so much, too much authority. You know, oh, you can have them get authority, you can give them up and be good. See, but as a man, we, again, we just can't get, get treated like shit. We just get treated like, hey, y'all are the bad guys, y'all are this and that. Y'all deserve to pay for a child. Pay, pay out your money. And ain't it so crazy how most of the time you got to have fucking money to get a girl in the first place. And then when you get fucked over by one, now you're losing what it took you to get one. I always say, how the fuck is a broke dude going to be able to get a girl, keep a real relationship? How? It's damn near fucking impossible. Why? Because ain't none of these girls out here on a higher level than a dude trying to help no fucking man. If anything, they looking for the next come up. So you got to have money. You got, How you going to pick your girl up? You know, you your girl stay 15, 20 minutes away. How you going to fucking pick her up? You ain't got a car. You ain't got no money. You ain't got shit. It ain't, it ain't that some bullshit, but a woman can be broke as hell. Ain't got barely shit going on. You can get all the dick she damn near want long as she look half decent. It shouldn't be like that. And that's because these damn men are giving these fucking women too much fucking play and respect. Stop it. Treat them how they deserve to be treated, man. Because right now, y'all, a lot of y'all dudes is just being fucking goofy, man. I'm sorry. It's sad, man. It's really sad to me because I, I just don't understand it. Like, don't you understand? Just like with the child support adoption thing. Like, do you not get it in your head, man? What? Because you were raised by a woman? That's probably why you won't see the truth. Because being raised by a woman means you're going to believe in a lot of fucking lies. Because it's fucked up. Because men seem like the only ones that will tell people the damn truth most of the time. Men seem like one of the only ones who are not that ashamed. Who are not that ashamed to tell people. But as you can see, these men raised by these women, these new age generations, especially this new age generation of men, boy. I mean, oh my God. The, the feminization is, is just horrible. I mean, they have too much respect for women. Like I said, I don't see no women coming and standing up doing what I'm doing, saying, hey, man, it shouldn't be like this. Men should have something. Hell no. I barely see any. I don't even really see them. Where they at? They too busy riding that train. They too busy having this free life, free expenses. People taking care of you for free. Easy job. She ain't got to worry about shit. Even if you have a baby being stupid by other people, you get taken care of. Just Everything's just good, y'all. Until it's too late. Until the end. Until the end game. Keep you away from reality until it get too late. And then you be like, oh, wow, we've been screwed. But it's too late because y'all not thinking. You know, women are thinking. They think it's good. Man, 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 man. Motherfuckers out here living the life and shit, giving up their kids for adoption, but it's me and I here paying fucking child support right now. Barely can even see a dollar. So now you paying for a baby and a woman you probably ain't even with or even got any control of, authority of, or nothing. You paying for it, can't even do shit, make you not even want to fucking talk to them because you ain't got no fucking control, they ain't going to do shit. It's ridiculous. Nothing. But they don't care. They don't care. They just like, whatever, man, you ain't shit. But they still run and chase nothing ass dudes. Hi, right, man. Like this video, comment. I'm going to holler at y'all later. Peace out.